I see a lot of unboxing about the uh, Intel Nuke on uh, YouTube, and I would thought I would show a little different video. Um, what are they good for? And I'll show you what I use them for. Might give you some insight of what you could use them for. I have three of them. These two are i3 models. This one's an i5. This one is a um, OSX version. It's a Hackintosh. Um, it runs my uh, lighting system in the house and the schedules the lights come on off at various times of the day or night. Uh, plus I can control it <clears throat> via my iPad or iPod. This one is running Windows 7 and it's strictly used to be a client to my uh, one of my TVs. So my video, my Blu-rays, DVDs, and even music uh, go through this and then they are displayed onto the television and or speakers, the sound bar, which is hooked up to the television. But this completely controls streaming all of my video. This, the i5, is my media kind of server. Um, it is what is kind of the brains of what video is streamed to here, or music, or my Sonos uh, music players. This controls it. This is running Windows 7. Um, strictly is a media server. It only dishes up the various movies. The movies, though, are actually stored on a Drobal 5 end. Um, I have a, a few hundred terabytes, a few terabytes of uh, a video, and they're all stored on a Drobal, and this controls the Drobal. This one also controls my voice over IP telephone system. Uh, as you can see, one of my TV uh, phones is right here. This controls that phone, and I make all of my calls and receive all my calls via the internet. Um, pretty reasonable price, so that's what I do. Plus, I install these, so I uh, usually do a lot of experimentation with programming. But anyway, I thought I would show you some functions that I use them for. These can be used uh, as a small desktop if you're checking mail, writing letters, and things like that. Um, not for gaming. They just don't have the horsepower for gaming. Uh, you can play solitaire. Uh, with the built-in window solitaire is not a problem. But I wanted to show you what I use them for so you can at least get some idea of uh, what they're good for. And you got to take in mind that even under full load, they're only running about 19 watts. So I would say my average on these is about 8 watts. Um, so 8 times 3, um, what, 24 watts um, is not very much compared to some desktops. Because these run 24-7. They never turn off. Unless you want to count this as being turned off. But I've had them online now for a few months. And uh, I, I don't think it cost me $3 a month to run them. Anyway, I thought I would show you what I use them for. And might give you some ideas what you can use them for. And I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, please leave comments in the um, comment section below the video. And we'll talk to you later.